Fucking old Gardenia. Oh shit, bro. And we're off, motherfucker! I don't want to that. No, bitch. Ding, ding, ding. Cutscene time. I lost my son to the calamity. The three seed seers are all together. Some say you couldn't take a step without stumbling over a body. Brutal. Our forebears were once strangers in the Twelves Wood. Fearful of the Green Wrath, they hid themselves in the dark recesses of the Earth. Yet they dreamed of basking in the dappled sunlight of the forest. Through great effort, they proved their worth to the elementals, and were granted a place beneath the boughs. So it was that Gradania was born, some five centuries ago. Working hand in hand, the Hure and the Elizan <sighs> settlers sowed the seeds of our civilization. And soon, they were joined by folk of all races. So nourished by the waters of unity, and blessed by the light of the matron, Gridania oh, flourished into the great <coughs> nation it is today. Do you see the Gridanian <laughs> Goodbye. Stand? There, hanging behind the elder seats here. The entwined serpents represent the unity between Hure and Elizabeth. An elegant symbol, do you not agree? In accordance mm, with the will of the elementals, we have embraced a life of peace. Alas, our neighbors have not always sought the same for themselves, nor for us. Though we Gridanians have no love for war, we have still less for those who would threaten our way of life. Ever have we fought to protect the sanctity of the Twelves War. When the Garlean Empire brought its War of Conquest to Eorzea, we rallied under the noble standard of the Twin Adder that we might push back the encroaching darkness. And it was we who prepared the ground for the reformation of the Eorzean Alliance, that all the peoples of this realm might stand united against the common threat. Five years ago, the Alliance met the armies of the Empire upon the fields of Cartano. It would prove the bloodiest battle in recent memory. Countless Gridanian lives were lost. As Supreme Commander of the Order of the Twin Adder, 
Ever shall I bear the weight of our people's sacrifice. Alas, their loss was not the only tragedy to befall us that day. For soon came the calamity. The scars borne by our forest are a constant reminder of its violence. Our lives have been irrevocably changed, each waking hour a struggle to survive. Driven to desperation, some among us have strayed from the path of righteousness, resorting to banditry, poaching, and other unconscionable deeds. To compound our woes, the Ixil have returned in force, emboldened by our suffering. Oh, no. They test our defenses nigh without cease, and prey upon the vulnerable. So beleaguered from within and without, it is of little wonder that our unity now falters. Dark times are upon us. Time was a man could the walk on the high bloody roads without fear. On this day, five years ago, countless Eorzeans laid down their lives that we might behold another dawn. Please join with me in honoring their memory. <clears throat> Request Cat and Pasta. And how do you propose to honor the memory of those you cannot remember, pray tell? The destruction wrought by the Calamity was indiscriminate. It dealt death to Eorzean and Garlean alike. Yet while we have labored to rebuild our homes, to rebuild our lives, the Empire has set about raising steel fortresses here in the Twelveswood. Let none be mistaken. The Garleans remain the greatest threat to our survival. If we are to stand against them, we must remember what it is to be united. Our many troubles blind us to the woes of our fellow man. Thence is harmony lost. Yet harmony is the founding principle of Gridania. We are gathered here to honor the fallen. Let them be honored not only in word and thought, but through concerted action. I bid you join hands with me once more beneath the Twin Adder Standard. And together, <clears throat> let us heal the forest's wounds, that our progeny might live in harmony beneath these ancient boughs. For serenity, purity, and sanctity. We must think of the children! Woods will be done! It's up to us to protect the forest! All the elementals! Drop deck on the elementals! Fancy meeting you again. Bro, you said that. You said it like two times. Planned, boy.
I mean, Garuda can get her ass whooped though, so like, you know. <clears throat> Alright, dopey and dipshit. Happy trails. Hero. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Instant transmission. Thank you very much. <sighs> the gods only know what grand company our adventurer friend will keep. Hm. The wheels of change are in motion regardless. Brother, are you certain this course is best? Whatever do you mean, dear sister? The so-called remembrance ceremonies were little more than standard-waving rallies. As though the Calamity and Seventh Umbral Era warranted scarcely a mention. Well, of course they were standard-waving rallies. Since you are so observant, mayhap you noticed what mention was made of the Warriors of Light? None. I suppose they must have forgotten the heroes who spared Eorzea a fate worse than the Calamity? No, dear Alizé, they haven't forgotten these details. They have elected to omit them. Deep are the wounds the Calamity inflicted upon Eorzea. So deep, in fact, that the realm still bleeds. Needless to say, the Beast Tribes and their Primals do little to alleviate the pain. So, the task of salving Eorzea's wounds falls to the Scions of the Seventh Dawn, with a little help from our friends, the Grand Companies. Remembrance will yield no remedy. If our world is to heal, we must put the horrors of the Calamity behind us. Father would never entrust the fate of the realm to despots who rewrite history to their convenience. You can't say that for certain, but yeah, sure. There must be another way to cure <laughs> what ails this world, and I mean to find it. You are most welcome to try. Our paths may differ, but our destination is the same. In time, I dare say, we will see eye to eye. I should hope so. M -m my lady! We are to escort you! Hope does not come into it. We share the burden of this fate, dear sister, and will prevail together or not at all. The salve will serve not only to close up our present wounds, but prevent old ones from opening a new one.
Yeah, buddy. Well. Hmm. You are definitely out. Most of my class quests are going to be in Ulda, so... What up, fool? Okay, fucking, okay, you want me to go to fucking Western Than and just beat the shit out of a bunch of fucking Garleans? I'm done. It was good, homie. I'm here to throw hands, you know how it is. little onion head up there. Hello.
Time to whoop ass is all I'm hearing, buddy. Oh, gee, you're under attack, all right. Handing out two pieces and a biscuit. Get out of here, your flash is trash. Be gone. What up, bitch? <laughs> Where are you going, trash ass? Come on, bitch. You running back and forth is not gonna help you survive, bud. Just saying. Oh, you died mid scoot. Oh, so sad. So so sad. It's fucking wigs at bed. What's good, y'all? Yeah, shit happens, bud. It's alright. Coolin'. Yeah, appreciate it, bro. The sweet science, a hey. for coin and country. Bit extreme, but okay. Mm. 
awkward. Private third class, all oh, shit. Salute, bitch. Fucking Oakley Doakley. Some launch your choke a little fucking yee haw. And it's up to you. Oh, wait, I have to do this uh, quest first. And then I can come back and get my choke a Yee haw! Roxas of Strife. Oh boy. Too much edge. Too much edginess. Joe Sandwich. So. <laughs> oh shit, it's it's a fucking big chungus and fucking small onion. Yeah, true, 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 true. Let's pick this shit up and... Now, having set aside the formalities, we have a favor to ask of you. Yeah, oh boy. Arianger, have the documents arrived from the students of Baldessian? Aye, my lady. They yeah, arrived, but recently. We have conducted a study at the behest of the Order of the Twin Adder. Papalimo, Ida, a synopsis, if you would. Our task was to survey the behavior of the Sylphs, a beast tribe indigenous to the Twelveswood. Oh, how to describe them. They look like gizzle greens, 
floating ones that worship the primal Ramu. Ahem. <clears throat> Though technically a beast tribe, sylphs are blessed with a comparatively personable demeanor, conducive to peaceful communication. Okay. Offering us an invaluable opportunity to learn what the beast tribes know of the primals. While Ramu's existence is well documented, the sylphs do not, or perhaps cannot, summon the primal any longer, insofar as can be ascertained, until such time as we know. It would be unwise to assume that the threat posed by the primal has passed. Okay. Which leaves Gridania with the added worry of not knowing what they should be worrying about. In that regard, they are hardly alone. What we can say with absolute certainty is that Gridania has its hands full fending off Garuda. Who, I need hardly remind you, is among the most savage and terrible of all known primals. In short, it is essential that we approach the Sylphs in as diplomatic a manner as possible. Okay. Words and actions can be misconstrued. The only sure way to communicate our intentions is the echo. This is where I Winning the Sylphs' favor may well bring us a step closer to mitigating the threat of the primals. Will you help us? I am grateful. Lovely. Well, as much as I'd like to help, I'm afraid I would be of little use to anyone in Gridania. A veritable babe in the woods. Ida and Papalimo, however, should be able to see the forest for the trees. Is that not so, Minfilia? Indeed. You are willing? Leave it to me. Us, Ida, us! Good times. Good times. Yes, yes, yes. Fuck Ogredania. Give me a fucking chocobo, bitch. I totally got my shiny fucking chandelier mander. I can't say I'm too surprised by that. Mm. Oh, wrong fucking person. Hey, buddy. Piece of trash. Bro, what you training for? Oh, you mean like training it? I'm like, bro, what are you like? Are you gonna you know, spend a fucking tournament or something? Like. Unlock mounts. What's up, buddy? 
sweet. Burb acquired. Yeah, go for sure. Hey, must be the money, burrito bandito. Bro, oh, you fucking clown. I guess this is where, uh... Probably just going to stop fucking recording. Yeah, buddy. Just gonna log out the normal way. Hey! via the bed.